Hello you guys, I am going to be reviewing the CD I bought yesterday at the end of 2011, this one, Amy Winehouse. I'm going to be reviewing the CD. Okay, <clears throat> the first song it is Our Day Will Come. I'm just going to name off all the ones I love. <clears throat> first one, Our Day Will Come. I love that song. It is so beautiful. It kind of sounds like Just Friends. Someone um reminded me of the song Just Friends while I was listening to it. Yeah, it, it kind of sounds like Just Friends, but it's not Just Friends. It is one, I think, one of the best songs off of the album. Hey, you want to Scott? Between the Sheets. I like it. I think this song will have to grow on me. Um... I like it. Yeah, it has to grow me. There's a few songs that have to grow me on the CD. Um, Tears Dry, the original version. I love it. I love it. I, lo I love the original. I have a story about the original, but uh, I'm not going to get into that. Uh, Tears Dry, I love that song. Um, Will You Still Love Me Tomorrow? Amazing. Like Smoke, Future Nas. That has to grow on me. Valerie, I love it, but I would like to have it. Should have they put out? Should have put the uh, Mark um, Robinson version of it. Um, the girl from Ipanema has to grow on me. Halftime is my shit. That is my jam, my cut. Um, I just love the song. This is the number one song on the album, Halftime. Um, wake up alone once again. That's my shit. I love this shit. Um, the original recording, I love it. Um, best friends, right? Has to grow on me. Body and soul has to grow on me, and a song for you has to grow on me. So that is my review for um, Amy Winehouse's new CD. Um, I suggest. Um, Amy Winehouse, she's the kind of artist with well, this CD. She's the kind of artist you have to have a, just an acquired taste to listen to. Most people that um, I know, when I listen to Amy Winehouse, they'd be like, turn her off or this, that, and the fourth. But you have to really, like, people are like, you ain't, you tired of, you, you ain't tired of her? I'm like, no, I ain't tired of her. Um, you have to have a certain taste for it. Um, it's just, I don't know. I think more um, older people will get into her. I think you really have to have a mature mindset to really get into Amy Winehouse. I'm not saying that the people I know don't have a mature mindset, but you really have to. It's just certain, certain, you have to acquire a lot of patience or time. Cause her song, most some of her songs are slow, and a lot of people nowadays don't like slow songs. But I love slow songs, and I love Amy Winehouse's. I love Frank to back to back, and I love the. I like this one. This is a B minus C plus B minus, but the other two were um, Frank was a, a A plus for me. Black to black was a A minus to me, and this is a B minus C plus. So. <clears throat> I think it is worth my money because it's adding on to my collection. Um, I just love everyone else. Um, somebody that is very inspiring. Uh, I just love her. It's just something I cannot explain. So I just bought this yesterday. I was irking people like, I need to buy it. 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 Now that I bought it, I like it. Um... Would I get my money back? No. Um, it's really for a mature audience. Yeah. Yeah. So that is my review on um, the CD. So, and inside the booklet, wait one second. Inside the booklet is the cover. Um, some people paying tribute to her. 
um, talking about how they came up with the concepts of the song or when when it, when um when what gave them inspiration with Muse, their Muse, this, who gave them inspiration. Um, yeah, this is a beautiful picture. And then it has the lyrics because and a song I'm singing a song for you the last song, um, I can barely hear it's just me but it's probably just me but I can barely um, hear the words that she's singing. Um, if you know the song by heart you'll know what she's saying but me being a person of this generation I don't know the whole song and lyrics but. I would recommend you buying it if you have the time to read the lyrics and if you can really feel her emotion, you should buy it. If you like the two last, the um, first two albums, you should buy it. If you didn't, don't buy it. See me, I like the last two albums, so I bought it. But that's just me. That's my opinion. Opinions are like assholes. Everybody got one. So, yeah, so that's my review. And, um, if you think, if you have different opinions than me, please comment on it. You know what I mean? Let me know. And if you're watching this and you're um, sitting on YouTube or Facebook or whatever, please subscribe. Subscribe. Thank you so much. Okay, bye.